the drums for self-determination beat in Yenagoa, the capital of the Ijo homogeneous state of Bayelsa. The Ijo National Congress calls it a peace walk and rally in Bayelsa and other states of the Niger Delta with a theme taking Ijo quest for freedom beyond mere rhetoric. We therefore need to rejig our strategies to move away from the old path of violent advocacy to non-violent methodologies, employing the tools of intellectual engagement based on our established rights and privileges and non-violent resistance. The struggle for self-determination for the job people. We shall continue to champion the fight against inequality, inequity, oppression, deprivation, the domination of the Jaw people anywhere. The Jaw National Congress has joined other ethnic nationalities in Nigeria wanting to opt out from this contraption called Nigeria because of the inequalities, because of the injustices which have been meted upon the Jaw nation. And that, I say, we are living, it's no more going to be a mantra, we are living rhetorics, we are now going on through processes now to actualizing self-determination for Ijo people. Ijo people must be free. Recognizing an Ijo day is just like part of the, the Kayama Declaration, resource control and self-determination. So this is a way of enlightening the people that we are still in a struggle. So a purpose with unity will enable us to achieve you know, the, 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 the set of objectives. Like Bayelsa, Rivers and Ondo states, the Ijaws in Delta State mark the day in worry. Today therefore marks a watershed in the history as a people as you commit to the pursuit of this goal within the ambit of all legitimate civil and legal protocols under the purview of international status. Ufietime George, Arise News.